you have to be able to assess information uh, to the best of your ability and may do so also with the assistance of a team member uh, t before decisions are made. Um, so uh, go through whatever necessary steps to do your due diligence, whatever that may be. Uh, in our case, it's reviewing financial statements. Uh, we're looking at three to five years of financial statements. We're assessing cash flow. We're looking at the changes in cash flow and the differences of one year to the next and getting a great understanding of what has taken place with that company and then going back to the leaders of that company to get some questions answered that we could not answer on our own uh, before any decision is made. So decision making it really involves gathering as much information as you possibly can on the front end, uh, making sure that it's accurate and that you have evaluated it properly uh, before any decisions are made. And it may require someone else looking at it other than yourself uh, to assist in that decision making before. There, there's a, a great scripture that says, in the multitude of counsel there's safety. And so it doesn't harm you to really get someone else's opinion uh, before a final decision is made. I think it helps you. Uh, so not to make a decision in a vacuum, as they say. Get others involved.